An Illinois woman who lost her dog eight years ago never imagined her beloved pet would end up in Hawaii. It's a story we just can't stop talking about. Cheryl Jan's Boston Terrier was recently turned over to the Hawaii Humane Society in Kona. KITV 4's Cam Tran tells us how the dog ended up thousands of miles away from home. It's all new at 6. Oh my God, just getting her into my arms. That's the only thing Cheryl Jans can think about. She's eager to reunite with her Boston Terrier, Koki. The Illinois resident gave Koki to an ex-girlfriend during a breakup eight years ago. I figured, you know, um, she was going to live her life where she was, and that was that, and I'd never see her again. Jans is a big animal lover. She lost touch with her ex and didn't know she had moved to Hawaii, but she kept one lifeline open to Koki. I gave up Koki, and... Um, but I, I didn't want to give up the right to Koki, so yeah. I wouldn't choose the microchip. Because I always thought, you know, if anything ever happened, they can only contact me if she dropped off somewhere. And that's exactly what happened. About a week ago, Jan's ex-girlfriend's mother turned Koki over to the Hawaii Island Humane Society in Kona. The Humane Society was able to track down Jan in northern Illinois. This is really another story of microchipping work. Because... It allowed us, her name was registered to Koki, and so it allowed us to find her and try to reunite these guys. Jan is a school teacher and says she doesn't have the money to fly to the Big Island to claim Koki. So she started this fundraiser page, hoping to cover the travel expenses and the cost to bring Koki up to date on her shots. I found a good Samaritan via the internet who was actually taking care of Koki until I could get her back to the mainland. Until she finds the funds, Jan's dreams about the happy reunion and how she'll catch up on the eight years of lost time. Being reunited with the cat Rumi that she knew when she was a baby, who's now, he's now 15, and they were like super tight. That relationship, they'll be together again, and it makes me so happy. Camp Tran, KITV4 News. What a story there, and what a little face oh, Koki no. has. A local transport company has offered to fly Koki to California, and Jan is considering it as an option. She is halfway to the amount she needs to bring Koki back to the mainland, and we wish her the best of luck. Yeah, I bet you that cat is just waiting to see his friend. <laughs> All right, more.